man, man, I can't remember the last time I've been up here and there's this much snow still. I mean, normally it's, normally it's in the morning there's snow and when you come back down the hill there's no snow. This has been here a while. Some of it's got a good hard crust. Some of it's been refluffed, but it's there's it's definitely deep in a couple places. It's still six inches deep, so it's been a buildup and it hasn't disappeared. But I can honestly say I haven't I haven't seen it like this maybe in ever. I, I can't remember, but it sure is pretty. So, here we go. We're on the board. I don't know if it's a fresh one or if it's an old one. It looks like it's chewed on. But it's a good one. It's an older one. Man, that's a good one. We'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take it. Hell yeah, on the board for the day. Well, won't go home empty handed. Still wondering where all the browns are at. But uh, I'll take this all day. Anything's better than getting skunked. Here's a pickup. Still a heavy sucker. He looks familiar. I'm gonna have to check. But he looks familiar. Kicker. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Awesome. So I, I didn't really do anything that I intended to do other than go for a hike and find a shed antler. Um, I had two areas that I was, was thinking about going out. Didn't go to either one of those areas. Instead, I went to a different area and I'm really glad I did. I picked up one shed and it leads us down the road to the probably one of the if not the biggest buck that i have ever gotten on camera and he was harvested in 2020 and i found his he would have been packing this in 18. it would be shed year 2019 that he would have dropped this the other side i possibly could find the sheds for 2020 he broke his he broke one side and the other side has been picked up i know that for sure uh it has been picked up i know who who got it um so we could possibly get three years of this buck i mean i don't have the rack because i didn't shoot him but anyway this is fun so, uh, yeah, this made my day. I decided, yep, yeah, it's time to just come back. Uh, there was lots of snow, um, and I just didn't want to have to rush myself through it. So I came back after finding this one, and it was worth it. So, yep, this is 
legend he's starting to do a split right there you can see starting to crown out right there All right, so we have our first of the trip. Um, I'm using my GoPro. I was uh, nice enough to leave my cam my phone, camera, etc. at home. Good thing I have my buddy here, Mason. He's uh, he's showing me the way. He's my guide today. Um, but eh, without further ado, here we go. And there it is. It's a big one. <sighs> A little chewed on, but we're gonna take it. First one of the day. Now it's Mason's turn. We need one for him. Ready? What do we find? First shot of the day. Oh, nice, and it's kind of buried down there. Oh, an eye guard. Ooh, look at that eye guard. It's a good. Oh, that's a good shed. First shot of the day. Ooh. Bad one. Not a bad one. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Very good. Very good. That's worth the hike. Oh, yeah. All he right. Some height on him. Yeah. Yeah, he does. Hmm. Look at that eye guard. It's a freaking eye guard. Hmm. Nicely done. Uh, under the brown. Well, I got my second one. Probably about the same age. Maybe a little smaller though. But with further ado, here. <laughs> yep. Oh well, it's one to add to the pile. <laughs> 